spunky and full of life. Just a few of the descriptions for RE-74 or Benny. But on December 29th, it was a different story. And he was shaking his head back and forth as if agitated and trying to free something from his mouth. On the 30th, he showed up at Coalina Resort, but was then spooked off the beach uh, and then ended up here at White Plains. It was at that point that the NOAA crew tranquilized the 350 pound monk seal and brought him to their Fort Island facility. They ran a scope there that explained his agitation. This four inch circle hook was embedded in his stomach. This is really, really big, and that's why I was pretty shocked. It was Dr. Yoshioka and his team knew they needed to act fast. It was going all the way up from the stomach through the esophagus up to his mouth, so it was very long, and it's fortunately we were able to. That the volunteers saw him because he could not survive with that. The team spent three hours removing the hook and steel leader. Benny bounced back nicely, but NOAA officials say this incident serves as a reminder for those fishing around our islands. We ask folks to, when you can, fish responsibly. If you know that you've hooked a seal, please call. We've had cases where uh, fishermen have reported accidentally hooking a seal, and we were able to save those seals' lives. And today, a bittersweet moment for the team as Benny shimmied back into the water, bystanders cheering him on. He looks back one last time at the group that saved his life. Reporting from White Plains Beach, Ashley Moser, KITV4 News.